Y'all get ready? Yes, you get ready. Shout out to all my tea sippers out there. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your tea cups ready because you already know this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, I hope you guys are doing good today. So I want to come on here and talk about the whole Britney Taylor, Remy Ma situation. So if you guys do not know what went down yesterday on Instagram is that Britney Taylor, who is all of four foot ten, OK, she is from Love and Hip Hop, New York, and she's a messy, messy bitch. So what happened is that she took to Instagram basically to go off and put Remy Ma on blast. She showed the world a picture of her black eye and then she went on to caption the picture this. She says, so here I am on my way to a very important meeting and it's hard to even focus because of what occurred last night. I didn't want to bring it to social media because it's pretty embarrassing and not a good look to be honest. I tried my best to cover it up with makeup and move on, but it still didn't work. My question is, at Remy Ma, why did you really do this? Hashtag what happened to women empowerment and hashtag black love. So, of course, when she posted the picture, she also posted a video. It didn't have any sound. It was muted, but she was showing people that this is not like a Photoshop job. Her eyes really blacked. So, y'all go ahead and check this out really quick. All right, so you guys just saw that video. So, you know, I've been trying to research exactly what happened. Of course, neither Remy Ma or Papoose has spoken out about the situation. But from what I'm hearing, they're saying that Remy Ma performed at a Pretty Lou Benefit concert in New York City with Fat Joe. Um, it was basically a great cause. It was one of those fuck cancer causes. And so she was performing. And so they're saying that Britney Taylor was also there as well. And there were some words exchanged. Other people were saying that Papoose's daughter was there. And Britney Taylor got, you know, real disrespectful with Papoose's daughter. Um, and then that's when the fight ensued. So there's quite a few rumors going around. But it does look like Remy Ma may have punched her in the eye. A lot of folks are really upset because if you guys don't know, Remy Ma was on The Real not too long ago, basically telling the world that she's on probation for the next five years. And you have to say, I have to say, I'm going to host The Real. No I'm flying way. on this flight. This is the hotel that I'm staying at. This Wait, is the how thing long I'm do you have to do that? Five years. She ended up on probation back in 2014, and she's scheduled to get off in 2019, but most likely that won't be until September 2019. So Britney taking the social media and putting everything out there may get Remy Ma in trouble if they're able to prove that Remy Ma hit her. That might affect her probation. That might extend her probation. It could even possibly land her back in prison. So this entire situation is just really crazy. I hope that's not the case. Britney has always rubbed me the wrong way, okay? I did not like her on Love and Hip Hop New York, and I'm glad that they got rid of her. All she did was cause drama. All she did was go back and forth. Her ego is so huge, it's just nauseating, okay? And I remember when her and Remy Ma got into it at the reunion, because Remy Ma was trying to give her some words of advice, and she kept trying to talk back, and then she accused everybody of being on Bianca's side, and, you know, she just didn't want to listen to reasoning. I want you guys to go ahead and watch this video really quick, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. When I see you, I'm going to do X, Y, and this. It's no rules. Like, you can't jump me, though. You can't sneak me, though. No. No. Be prepared. You can't make threats. I'm not threat. I'm not I'm not threat. Threat. Yeah. This when I catch you, I'm going to drag you. I honestly feel like I'm being jumped right now. Like, y'all really, like, doing a lot. Like, this is just good. I'm sorry. Like, this is Slow ass down. Remy, why are you coming because for me, though? Because, because you're sitting here. You why are you coming? Because, because I feel like you're just me. being subliminal. Because you do tell Malato. 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 I blamed Bianca when me and, her and Yandy sat down. Who did I blame? Me. I got but the problem that I have and why people too. think I'm taking sides is because I can't sit around just listen to <laughs> You can't make threats to people. Okay. You can't say anything and then when something happens to you, cry the victim. That's a lot of these bitches do that. And I apologize for getting hyped with you because I should have more respect for a queen like you, No, you know I, mean? I appreciate you saying that, but you, it's not about me being a queen. That's this whole thing. <laughs> this, is, this ain't about no rap <laughs> on this queen of rap Oh, I don't give a f listen to me. I didn't have everything taken away from me. When I was sitting in that f cell, I wasn't in there praying for a mother f song. I was praying for my son. I was praying for my f husband. I was praying for my family. I was praying for my f sanity. So I don't give a f about this rap. What I want you to do, and this is me just being the realest that I can be to you. Stop playing these social media games. People get hurt I'm every day from playing on social media. Brittany, you're four 
10, baby. What does that mean? That means that you're really Four little. That's what that means. I don't care. It's kind of impossible to be with the care. when you're 410. All right, so you guys just watched that video. So in my personal opinion, Miss Brittany Taylor, she definitely knows what she's doing. She's always starting shit. She's always popping off. And then when she gets that same energy back, then she's a victim. The thing that bothers me with this is that she should know as a grown adult, because she's a grown woman now, okay, that there's some people you just don't play with. So if you want to sit there and leap, don't get mad when somebody gets froggy with your ass, okay? And Remy Ma done shot her damn best friend over a damn rack, bitch. So I don't see her not popping you in your fucking I for being disrespectful to her Remy's unproblematic she's over here trying to take care of her new baby she's married she has her husband so for her to pop off and put hands on Britney trust and believe Britney had to have done something talk shit get hit run up get motherfucking done up point blank period okay so hopefully you know what I'm saying nothing comes of this as far as Remy and her probation but Britney is one of those toxic ass people who just brings a toxic energy that you just need to stay the hell away from okay if you know she's gonna be at an event it's probably better for you to just stare clear of that event because any event that's attached to Britney or that Britney shows up to she just brings a dark cloud with her just a few months ago back in September she was beefing with Amara La Negra calling her out and everything else you know she's always on social media media popping off and beefing with people for attention but yet and still I don't hear any music coming from her you know what I'm saying I don't see anything popping on the billboards all I know her for is drama okay so anyways y'all let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation once again concerning Britney Taylor basically putting Remy Ma on blast and potentially getting her in trouble with her PO so let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces